Yeah, you gotta love. Oh, Jesus Christ. And someone's living here with their cats. I'm not sure if that's what he meant about cat ladies, but. The TikTok content creator Mike, well, I'm sorry, Inspector Mike, is showing us his tenant of the year. Okay. Yeah. Looks like my old apartment. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> Where we at? Where we at? Come on. <laughs> yeah, let's go. <laughs> it's Fish Jump Podcast. Aww. Let's go. And here we are again at another totally remodeled unit. And yeah, you gotta love. Oh, Jesus Christ. And someone's living here with their cats. I'm not sure if that's what he meant about cat ladies, but that's what this is about. Let's move on. There's the, there's the cat. Oh, yeah. And that's where she sleeps. Oh, my Jesus. Mary and Joseph. Okay, we're going to move into the other areas here. Yeah, it's the wide angle so we can really appreciate it. Yep, somebody lives here full time. There's the kitchen table for entertaining. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, you're still in here. Yeah. The sound of the voice, I think that was the tenant. I think that was the tenant. First of all, the okay. sound of the voice. You know what? And I'm going to speak on this on behalf of me as a landlord. Ain't no way in hell. First of all, why is he not doing regular inspections? There should be no reason why that how apartment, whatever, looks like that. So do you, 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 do, you do regular inspections on your properties? At least once a year. Yes, you got yeah. to. It's, it's no way that that looks like that. And so let's just say she had some kind of repair or whatever. Yeah. That t first of all, I could tell that Tula was running. So at some point, you get in the water bill. I bet that water bill is high. You get in the high water sale. bill showing that, that the, the, the water bill is escalating. So at what point do you go to the apartment to figure out why? Yeah. What needs to be fixed? That's years and years of the crap. filth. Right. Listen, for me, for my properties... What I do is in my in in the lease language, I put that there's going to be a mandatory monthly inspection. Do I go? Oh, every, that's a good idea. Do I go every month? No, but I want but you to. Is in there. Yeah, so because if I see that you're going to be a, a tenant like that, yeah, now I'm coming every month. I'm coming every thirty days because I want you to be on your p's and q's. If I see after a couple months that you're good, yeah, we probably do every six months to a year, but. There's no way in the world as, a, as an active landlord mm -hmm. you let your place get like that. Like that place, excuse me, ma'am, I'm going to need you to get your cats, get yourself. Yeah, I got to throw a bomb in here. And, and like literally blow no, this whole... You, you throw the whole goddamn apartment. No, away. I mean a grenade, not oh, a, not a grave bomb. <laughs> or a grenade. Like, throw it away. I'm going to blow everything out of yeah, the I'm blowing this whole away. building up. Like, the hell? That's just nasty. First of all, you can just tell that that apartment stinks. You can just well, look yeah, because look at all of the clutter. No. And the no. feces, the First fecal all, matter. Obviously, she don't take baths. Look at the tub. And and at the end of the day, if that is a multi multi unit property, oh, you as know. a landlord, oh. you could get in trouble for that. Like for her unsanitary yep. conditions, mm -hmm. the tenants mm -hmm. start complaining. Now that's your problem. Yeah, so, because let's just say she got mice and roaches in it. Now that's going to start traveling to the other tenants. Not mice. Not nah, Mike. I'm oh, not saying her, Mike. Yeah. They definitely are. Yeah. They definitely are. That's just horrible. Horrible. But you know what? Now, I think that whoever the tenant is has some sort of she's mental a illness. Yeah, she's a hoarder. Possibly. Something. Yeah, no, because there she is, is no, no reason, no rhyme that your apartment should be looking like that. Yeah, but Period. still, again, that's more than one year's worth of filth. Oh At yeah. At some point, as a landlord, Wait, when do you did you see the way the dirt and filth was oh, caked up yeah. around the toilet yes, and around, around the, the, tub? The, the, the tub? Because she's oh, a my gosh. she's a, because what a, what a lot of landlords do is when you have when you have the non complaining tenants, they just let them rock. Never Especially check it in. She's paying. So she probably never. Yeah, she probably paid on time. Yeah. And just never said anything. So he like, all right, I'm gonna uh, let it continue. Yeah, just, I'm gonna just let her do a thing. Long yeah. as I'm getting, because it's all about the money. Long as I'm getting the money, and it's like at the end of the day, like I said, she can no, cost you a lot. Because at the end lot. of the day, when she move out, imagine how much money he gonna have yeah. to pay to fix that dad gonna play. Right. 
He's going to have to tear all of that Everything. stuff out. Yeah, it's going to be a brand new, brand new ground up oh, dead near apartment. So let's go to one comment. So let's go to the first. First comment is from uh, Tony. Is it uh, Tony Jane Garcia? Jane Garcia says, "Is there a model in the room with us?" <laughs> 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 I, I ain't seen no goddamn remodel. That was not a modern day apartment. <laughs> even if it was modern day, we wouldn't even be able to tell. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. With all, with, yeah. With all them cans and plates and everything all over the place. And now oh. you now, I hope our viewers understand. There's a reason why people charge pet fees. Yeah, because pets add more. You know, dirt more. They can add more filth, especially if the uh, the, the owner's not cleaning up. Yeah, mm -hmm. it just adds on to it mm -hmm. more. So now, yeah, that's why we got pet fees because stuff like that. Yeah, like that's true. And there's no way in the world that lady had one cat. D and just I was just oh, wait, hold on, wait, wait a minute. Did, did we see one cat? I yeah, saw the black one. Cat. I saw the black cat. Yeah. that was on top. The black of the, cat. Yeah, yeah. she but has I'm way more sure than one she cat. Had more, way more. But the black cat was like. Get me the fuck out of here. <laughs> he was in that one spot like, player, listen, once you head out, uh, leave the door open. Leave the door. Right behind you, baby. <laughs> I was never able to escape. I'm out, bitches. Finally, y'all, they came and rescued me. <laughs> yeah, hey, all right. Second comment is from Kyra. Kyra says, remodeled about 1937. <laughs> yeah, you know, I didn't see anything new. No. The stove was old. The tub was old. The toilet the toilet was old. Everything was old in that bad boy. So man. once again, like, like CJ was saying, like if you have this tenant that's been in there for years and she's paying and paying and paying. He so you ain't checking up on her, right? He ain't nope. doing no upgrades to that. Oh, mm. He not doing no upgrades, so which means he probably wasn't increasing the rent either. But you could tell it, it looked like it was an efficiency. You see how yeah, it, it was, was really how small, was. small and tight. Yeah, it was the space mm -hmm. room, the, the the bedroom, the bed was there, and he yeah, turned the corner. I, there was and, no and way for her to sleep. How could she sleep on top of that stuff like that? Because it's a mental issue. Like she don't know that mental she don't see it. Yeah. yeah, hoarding is a, they have a whole show about hoarding. Yeah, because them people they really mentally they be off and they don't be seeing it. Mm hmm. Yeah. That's yeah. crazy. I could just imagine during the summer, I don't know where they're located. How but it smells. Oh, my oh God. Oh, my God. On a hot Ooh. ass day. Oh. Bobby on fire. Smell like the goddamn zoo. Mm. Man. Yeah, say, stop all that hoarding, y'all. Get some mental health. Get some help. Listen, I wouldn't, if I order, listen, if I lived in that building, I would never eat in the house. I would move. I How mean, about that? I mean, if yeah. I can't break my lease, I would I, move. I'm, I'm never eating in the house. Yeah, but you know the sad part about it is, is because I've cleaned um, someone's house that was a hoarder. That was a hoarder, was a hoarder before. Was it terrible? It was horrible. It took me two days. Just Are you to, serious? Just to clean, just the downstairs. So, like, did you, just did you just a, get like a a, 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 a a shovel? Man, and just shovel and shit. When I tell you, it was me and my two sons. They was literally throwing everything out. I would throw that. But out. Guess what? He needed that house cleaned again that next year, and it looks like we never was in there. Seriously? Seriously. See, that's, that's Seriously. a mental condition, mental health condition. Yeah, because it's like, all right, but it, for me, I'm like, all right, yeah, you can pay me again. Yep. Mm -hmm. Not me. <laughs> Once is enough. Huh? Uh, I done came back and said, oh, wait. Uh, yeah, so um, I got a herniated disc. I ain't gonna but you know it. what? The funny thing about it was, is like, because this was a guy, so I guess to him, to an extent, he, he mm -hmm. felt some kind of way because it was like, you. I can clean the downstairs. Yeah, because I'm a female. But he didn't want me to go upstairs. I couldn't clean the upstairs. I only cleaned the downstairs. Yeah. He oh, please you, tell me what the upstairs look like. I don't know. Because he don't uh -huh. want you to see know. where he... He didn't want me to see it. He don't want you to see where he slang his thing and yeah. how it's looking. Yeah, he probably, he probably got like about 14 of them sex dolls mm. and shit oh, laying Lord. all over the place. <laughs> Don't knock the sex dolls. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah, please don't. Yeah, I mean, he over there hoarding them sex dolls. <laughs> All right, uh, let's go to, so we did comment number two. Let's go to comment number three. It's from Hannah Thompson. I feel like this is the landlord issue for not doing a yearly walkthrough. Yep. This is avoidable with annual inspections. That's yep. exactly said what it. I said. Y'all said it. Facts. Y'all said it. I'm telling you, like, again, it, it's a business. So you, you like, like T said, it's going to, it's going to, soon as she move out, it's going to cost him like 40, 50 grand to fix that. Just to fix that shit exactly. up. Exactly. And if you her security deposit out. is only 900, mm, oh yeah, my you, God. You might as well just give it back to her. <laughs> Fair. I can't do nothing with that. Like, you might as well take, on. I'm going to give it to you so you can take it to be somebody else's problem. Yeah. But you know. 
Yeah, that security ain't touching nowhere near the amount of repairs you got to do to that. Place. And so again, you think about it. That apartment was trash. If that's a multi-unit building, and he has other tenants that are just paying and don't have no issue, she probably it, not the only one. Yeah, you can have. He, he can say he got six apartments in that building. You can have four people that's like that. Yep. Mm, true. True. Yeah, I'm cool. True. Yeah, I tell you now, man. Make sure you drop a like, drop a comment, subscribe, and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? So listen, we want to everybody to send a uh, super chat and everything. You know what I mean? <laughs> we got a little super chatters. Yeah, yeah so the super chatters. We got a little message for y'all. <laughs> tell them the message, Lowe's. <laughs> Tell them the message. Yeah, tell them the message. Okay, bye, bitches. <laughs> <laughs>